city where everyone is living the dream. Again, all of them. I just wrote it. <laughs> all of them. These are their ideas. No one knows about it. Well, hardly anyone. But two scientists have been conducting experiments there for years. We really have been living the dream, haven't we, Dr. Veroni? Yes, we certainly have. Dr. Bridges running our secret lab has been amazing. What? To think of that to think of all that we have accomplished. My favorite was the talking donkey. What? Oh, he was great. I already went on to star in a famous movie. He did. I loved love the donut that got got bigger bigger every time we bit into it. That was so yummy. What? What should we do next? Well, I've been thinking about more food. I've been thinking about how much I love pancakes. Pancakes are the best. Let's make pancakes that can multiply, too. Okay. Working with the best crayons they had, the two scientists got to work. They thought long and hard. They planned. They calculated. They got hungry. I'm so hungry I could eat this crayon. I know, me too. But the pancake experiment is almost done. Dr. Bridges, we must be patient. I can't be patient. I want pancakes now. Dr. Bridges waved her arms around so hard that she knocked her hand into the experiment. Oh no, what have I done? Oh no, the pancake goo is dripping into the make things talk goo. All of a sudden, a talking pancake springs forth. Where am I? What am I doing? Who am I? Well, um, you are a talking pancake? Wait, what? I mean, what? You are a talking pancake? No, this isn't right. I can't be a talking pancake. I'm supposed to be Justin Bieber. <laughs> kind of say, kind of the same thing, huh? <laughs> stop that pancake! He's running into everything. But the scientists could not stop the talking pancake in time. In fact, the pancake.